Hey y'all, it's Michelle. I am ready to react to the next Marvel movie after Iron Man 3. And I think we're done with the Iron Mans. He took the thing out and he had the surgery and they removed all the shrapnel. Like, why are we doing that now? Why? Oh well. I, it just makes me nervous because he's... The armor is uh, gone. <laughs> but I did state this at the end of that movie that I think him and Fury are just going to be consulting and getting more of these Avengers together. This is Thor, The Dark World. So we're going back up into their universe. Not happy with Loki. I felt really bad for him in the in the first episode of just, you know, Thor. I don't know. I'm I'm losing <laughs> hope for him. He's just turned bad, I think. But I'm anxious to see what happens. We'll just talk about it afterwards. All right, let's do this. Long before the birth of light, there was darkness. And from that darkness came the dark elves. <laughs> Millennia okay. ago, the most ruthless of their kind, Malekith, sought to transform our universe back into one of eternal night. Such evil was possible through the power of the ether, an ancient force of infinite destruction. Malekith could at last unleash the ether. Oh. But Asgard ripped the weapon from his grasp. Without it, the Dark Elves fell. With the battle all but lost, Malekith sacrificed his own people in a desperate attempt to lay waste to Asgard's army. Yep. And the ether was no more. Okay. And he got away. So we were led to believe. Oh. Is that the ether? Shall we destroy it? If only we could. But its power is too great. Bury it deep. Somewhere no one will ever find it. This is like the ring and taking it back into the Mordor. And I want him and Jane to... He didn't get to see her during the Avengers, remember? Put that thing back over his mouth. Loki. Hello, Mother. I made you proud. Please, don't make this worse. Define worse. Enough! I will speak to the prisoner alone. Ooh. <laughs> I really don't see what all the fuss is about. Do you not truly feel the gravity of your crimes? Wherever you go, there is war, ruin, and death. I went down to Midgard to rule the people of Earth as a benevolent god. Just like you. We are not gods. We are born, we live, we die. Just as humans do. Give or take 5,000 years. All this because Loki desires a throne. Mm -hmm. It is my birthright. Your birthright! Was to die as a child, cast out onto a frozen rock. If I had not taken you in, you would not be here now to hate me. If I'm for the axe, then for mercy's sake, just swing it. Frigga is the only reason you're still alive and you will never see her again. You'll spend the rest of your days in the dungeon. Oh, I doubt that. I'm glad that... And what of Thor? The king is still alive, though. You'll make that witless oaf king while I rot in chains. Probably. Thor must strive to undo the damage you have done. He will bring order to the Nine Realms, and then... Yes. He will be king. Oh, we gotta bring order to... Okay, Vanaham. I'm not gonna remember all the Nine Realms. <laughs> Give them to me. Other than Earth. <laughs> I'll write him down. Oh, 
that door? Yeah. Boomerang. Oh. I love that stance. I've got this completely under control. Is that why everything's on fire? What's that? All yours. Hello? I accept your surrender. Okay, <laughs> don't be cocky again. Oh! The hell? Never mind. He's all rock. Anyone else? <laughs> Perhaps next time we should start with the big one. <laughs> He's gonna need all their help again. Alright, where are we going to now? Oh, the Rainbow Bridge. The first time since Bifrost was destroyed, the Nine Realms are at peace. They're well reminded of our strength, and you have earned their respect and my gratitude. This isn't about Jane Foster, father. Human lives are fleeting, they're nothing. You'd be better served by what lies in front of you. Mm. I'm telling you this not as the old father, but as your father. You are ready. The time has come for you to take the throne. Embrace and celebrate what you've won. Join your warriors. Eat and drink. Revel in their celebration. At least pretend to enjoy yourself. The, they're their families and loves of their life and yeah they are nine realms future king of asgard must focus on more than one i thank you for your sword and for your counsel good lady Sif. Oh, london okay blind date so what's the story with you <laughs> Why does there have to be a story? There's no story. You spent the first 10 minutes of our date hiding behind a menu that has three choices on it. It's either chicken, vegetarian, or fish, Jen. I think there's a story, and I'm thinking the story involves a guy. I always thought that was her sister, oh. but... So, <laughs> I show up to work at the lab slash your mom's house, fully expecting you to be moping around in your pajamas, eating ice cream, and obsessing about <clears throat> you know who. Uh. But you're not. You're wearing lady clothes? You haven't showered, didn't you? You smell good. Is there a point to all this? This is the reason we came all the way out here. It's malfunctioning. That's what I said. That's what I did. I thought you do something a little more scientific. Our friend Eric kind of want banana balls. He's not interested. I'm, interested. I'm not interested. Time for you to go now. You need to take the next life. Oh my gosh. Who's he? He's my intern. You have an intern? Oh, yeah. Uh, hello, Dr. Foster. It's, uh, it's a great honor to be working with you. I'm here at Stonehenge for what has been an interesting unfolding of events today. Okay. The police were called to the scene shortly after 11 a.m. this morning <laughs> after a seemingly harmless rambler approached the area, then decided to strip naked and effectively terrorize tourists there with scientific equipment while shouting that he was trying to save them. Ian, Darcy, and Jane. And naked Eric. <laughs> I hope he's okay in the head. Oh, oh hell. Are you the police? No, we're scientists. Well, I am. Thanks. We just found it. <laughs> okay, where'd y'all stumble onto? How can you do that? That doesn't seem right. <laughs> I think I'm Darcy. Without the smartness. <laughs> just... Well, that doesn't seem right. Where'd it go? going on that's that's incredible <laughs> something's luring her there it's not gonna be good 
because she's fascinated. What about the ether they were talking about? Where'd that go? Is that it? I don't like it. <gasps> oh, God. She's in the upside down. What's happening? <gasps> that is it. <laughs> Shit. That's it. Oh, good. She closed it. That's the ether. Oh, my gosh. One thing that didn't get destroyed. Yep, this bastard. How long have you been around? What? She's in trouble. The ether has her. I can't see her. Oh! See? What's it doing to her? I knew something was luring her. Oh no. That's not good. Tell me you didn't call the police. Oh. What was I supposed to do? Not call the police? I was freaking out. You call the cops, they call the feds. Next thing you know, we have shields crawling all over Area 50 wanting the place. Jane, we had a stable gravitational anomaly. We had unimpeded access. Our only competition was 10 years old. Jane, you were gone for five hours. What? Oh. See that? Sparkle? <gasps> Find out what the hell happened. Typical. Sorry, I just needed to make sure you were real. It's been a very strange day. Oh, I am. Jane, what? Okay, stop. Where were you? Where were you? <laughs> Heimdall could not see you. The Nine Realms erupted into chaos. Wars were raging. Marauders were pillaging. I had to put an end to the slaughter. As excuses go, it's not <laughs> terrible. <laughs> but I saw you on TV. You were you were in New York. Come with me. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> uh. She's a weapon now. Jane. That's what happened. Go. Take off. With her. Leave. Hold on to me. Yeah. What are you doing? Yes. It had to be done. I'm gonna be honest, I get a little nauseous. This is not of Earth. What is it? We do not know. I do. But she will not survive the amount of energy surging within her. <gasps> Does the soul forge transfer molecular energy from one place to another? Yes. Quantum field generator. I brought her here because we can help her. She does not belong here in Asgard any more than a goat belongs at a banquet table. Did he just... Who do you think you are? I am Odin, king of Asgard. Yeah. Protector of the Nine Realms. Oh. <laughs> well, I'm... I know very well who you are. You told your dad about me? Something is within her father. Something I have not seen. Her world has its healers. They call doctors. Let them deal with it. See? Wow. Touch her. And you think See, a right. mortal doctor is going to help her? It's impossible. I don't like that stuff. The infection. It's defending her. Odin continues to bring me new friends. How thoughtful. The books I sent, do they not interest you? Is that how I'm to while away eternity? Reading. It's a nice I've dungeon. I've in my power to make you comfortable, Loki. Have you? Does Odin share your concern? A true king admits his faults. You what of the lives you took on Earth? A mere handful compared to the number that Odin has taken himself. Your father... He's not my father! He raised you. He is. And am I not your mother? Get away. Oh, he's going to get 
out. You might want to take the stairs to the left. Return to yourselves, no further harm will come to you. You have my word. Very well, you do not have my word. Grab my throat for him. Take care. Despite all I have survived, my queen still worries over me. Mm. It's only because I worry over you that you have survived. Listen to me now. I need you to do everything I ask. No questions. Yes, ma'am. Oh, he sees what's going on. I know that. But don't leave your post. Don't leave your post. Oh. Okay. He saw that it was invisible before I did. Take it in. Oh. He stopped more. Oh, shit. That's the main one. That's the bad one, for sure. I don't understand. Oh, it's coming down. Protection's coming down. Frida. She's got Jane somewhere. Stand down, creature. And you may still survive this. I have survived worse, woman. She's badass. Ow. Ow. I'm holding my breath again. She protected Jane by doing that thing, like... <sighs> she was a good fighter, though. Aww. It's on now. This is war. This is it. Last straw. the lantern things that they do nowadays these are now yeah, well thank you and this is another world normally they're separate oh no but during the alignment everything is connected all nine realms all nine realms are passing through each other and gravity light and even matter is crashing from one world to the other any questions it's <laughs> not funny yeah can I have my shoe back? <laughs> Jane Foster, you need to come with us. Okay, her eyes were black. Just we now. are still unable to restore the palace shields. Our artillery cannot detect them. Even Heimdall cannot see them. His ship could be over our heads right now. We'd never even know it. If and when he comes, his men will fall on 10,000... As God in place. And how many of our men shall fall on there? As many as are needed! A lot, Dad. How many you got? Ah. Oh, his heart. He's not gonna live much We will longer. fight! We face an enemy that is invisible even to me. What use is a guardian such as that? Valakith will return, you know this. 
What I'm about to ask of you is treason of the highest order. Uh oh. Success will bring us exile, and failure shall mean our death. The Bifrost has been shut down and the Tesseract locked away in the vault. There are other parts of Asgard. Ways known only to a few. One, actually. No. Yes. Thor. After all this time, and now you come to visit me. Why? No more illusions. Oh, wow. Now you see me, brother. Okay. Destroyed him more than... Did she suffer? Than I thought. I did not come here to share our grief. <sighs> you must be truly desperate to come to me for help. What makes you think you can trust me? I don't. <laughs> Mother did. You mm. should know that when we fought each other in the past, I did so with a glimmer of hope that my brother was still in there somewhere. When do we start? He will betray you. I hope he will not. Try. See, Loki has me like this. I, I don't. This I don't is know so how unlike you, brother. Feel about him. I'm so clandestine. Ooh, here. I'm Loki. You may have heard. Of him. That was for New York. I like her. Stop Thor by any means necessary. Okay, that was the treason. Well, Thor's in on it too, oh, and take her. Thank you. I said, how hard could it be? Get it up. Get going. Mm -hmm. Gonna hold him off as long as he can. Whatever you're doing, brother, I suggest you do it faster. Yeah. Shut up, Loki. Today. <laughs> okay, it's okay. We were just taking him down. Oh, oh, oh. I think you missed a collar. Shut up. <laughs> Let's steal the biggest, most obvious ship in the universe and escape in that. Flying around the city, smashing into everything in sight so everyone can see us. Go it's invisible. It's brilliant, Thor. It's truly brilliant. <gasps> Go invisible. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Oh, okay. He's gonna leave as well. <laughs> I see your time in the dungeons has made you no less graceful, Loki. <gasps> I was like, he's done with him. Like, he's not going on this mission. You think you alone were loved of mother? You had her tricks, but I had her trust. Trust? Was that her last expression? Trust? Will you let her die? What help were you in your cell? Who put me there? Who put me there? You know damn well. You know yourself. damn well. Yourself. Okay. Let's not do this right now. Yes. Yeah. It's, uh, Darcy. Darcy. <sighs> so good to see you. Oh, uh, I missed you too. How did you find me? Just you were naked on TV. <laughs> Just get out. Okay, time to go. Lots to do. <laughs> Are you kidding me? No. That happened in his head. Or this is the plan. It was a trick. It's, it didn't really stab him. It's so that that other person thinks really it happened. Really think I cared about Frigga? Huh? About any of you? No. No. Oh. I ask only one thing in return. A good seat from which to watch Asgard burn. What's what's going on? I was getting it out of her. Well at least that saves her life, I think. Take it. I don't know. No! He's tie in. It was a plan. Oh, I'm 
sorry, Loki. Oh, shit, it's gonna put itself back together. Oh, nice try. Start hitting it. Don't, I'm not crying again. Oh! He saved him that time. What's he hitting? Oh, Thor. Loki? He's not really there. It's not really him. It's like the mother situation. He just redeemed himself. Bye, bitch. Okay. Oh, no. Is it really him? I fool, you didn't listen. I might not feel. I'm a fool. I'm a fool. Stay with me, okay? I thought I wasn't gonna do this again. I didn't do it for him. Did it for him or for his mother? Who did you do it for? It doesn't matter. Ah! Me. Hello? Good Wi-Fi. Jane, it's Richard. Richard? Where are you? I'm still at the office. It's a, it's been a crazy day here today. Oh my god, this is amazing. Is it? Oh. Oh. They're at the place. They're on Earth. Loki. We found a body. Loki. Malekith is going to fire the ether at a spot where all the nine worlds are connecting. Snowden, Great Orm, these are all coordinates taking us here. Greenwich. Greenwich. Oh, Greenwich. The walls between worlds Whatever. will be almost non-existent. Physics is going to go ballistic. Increases and decreases in gravity, spatial extrusions. The very fabric of reality is going to be torn apart. Oh. It always kills people in the process. Just not the whole country. Holy Just parts. Why? So far as Guardian. Woo. You know, with all that power, I thought you'd head harder. Are you trying to get him to get rid of it? Yes. Ah. Whoa. Look on some buildings. Gravitational fields interact with the weak spots between worlds. Okay, we oh, you get the guy with the sword! Okay, we don't have a time. We don't have time for um <laughs> explanation. Just do it. Let's go. Oh, um. shit. <laughs> oh. Oh, we're back in the dark world. Give him a big kiss. This <laughs> Mind the gap. Oh, 
take this train three stops. Behind the gap. Behind the gap. Sorry. Sorry. He's got to. He's got to get in it. He'll jump in it. Is at his peak. He'll jump in it. Those things stopping. Not from here. We can't get close enough. And then she's doing something now on Earth. Uh huh. You think you can stop this? I love how he's just like, and the hammer. Oh, sorry. Does this, and the hammer just finds him. Got it. Thor. You're gonna lift Thor. Oh, where's his hammer? Where's his hammer? She's laying on top of him. What? <laughs> yes. Woo. Uh, that doesn't mean he's gone. Everybody okay? I don't know. <laughs> Celebrate again. Total destruction. Always. I just can't get over that. Okay. Thank you for not shooting at us. <laughs> this is like that diner scene. Everybody's quiet. Where's Thor? He's gonna come back. Oh. Except, you know. Last time he was gone for like two years. Uh -huh. Oh, it's only been two days, so. Aww. Say anything before he left. Two years. Yeah, he had to figure some stuff out with his father. He kind of committed treason on our way out. What can Asgard offer its new king in return? Fix the throne. My life. Father, I cannot be king of Asgard. I will protect Asgard and all the realms with my last in every breath, but I cannot do so from that chair. Mm, I like that. What? No. Thank you. Are you freaking kidding me? I've cried twice over this guy. I can assure you, it will be absolutely safe here in cool? my collection. One down, five to go. How long's it been? Thor. I she just knew. She's gonna kiss whoever came out of that bolt of lightning or light. Glad it was them. This is what the fuck are still doing around. Marvel, that wasn't necessary. Thor will return. Ah, it's getting out or it's not telling us when. Well, I'm on a roller coaster of emotions. I've cried twice for Loki because I keep giving him a chance. That's it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it again. Was he faking it when he destroyed the dungeon? Like he really doesn't care about the mother and I know he wants to be king, that's obvious. Where is the king? He was portraying the king. Did he did he kill his father? Oh I'm sorry. It's he's not my father. Shut up. He raised you. And the lady 
is your mother. She raised you. Like, what's up his ass? I don't, I, I, other than jealousy and, you know, I need a backstory on, and it, I don't want a whole freaking movie about it, of, we, of them growing up together and the father, Odin, bringing him and raising him as his own. I want to, I want to see the relationship that he and Thor had like kind of through the years, like just take me through a 10 minute clip <laughs> uh, and then like to see when the jealousy set in or when did he th start thinking he, that he wasn't like them and or does he not find out and maybe he does in the comics. I don't know. I've had it with him. That was a good one. All these are leading. I know that I have to watch these in order for a reason. So with, with, <laughs> so with Iron Man 3, right, we saw the fire, like the, the fire stuff inside, and then we saw the, the guy when he was presenting, like, this is my brain to Pepper. We started seeing it in this one. Everything's going to come together at some point. That's why I'm watching these in a certain order. That's why I was told. Watch these in order, and I'm glad because this one, this one really had me confused for a little bit. Um, I think I kind of got a grasp finally of when we kept going back and forth between the dark world and our universe. Like the kids, that place, the kids had found where the ether was. They had found they would throw stuff up, and then it would disappear, and then another one would. It just kept. She found the items, and it was like, uh, so I was like, okay, okay, these are connected. The, this is, she saw that can up there, and it was like, okay, that's, the, all that happened on Earth. So that kind of started to make sense a little bit for me. They really got me with the teasing of, was Loki betraying Thor? And he chopped off his hand, and I'm like, what? Like, Thor won't have a hand now going forward? Like, then I was like, I'm like, no, 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 no. And then it all just like, I don't know. I just was, I, I forget what happens after that. <laughs> but Loki's still whatever. And, and, and Thor says, now. And then my, I just was like, yes, it was a plan. Okay, good. Then he gets stabbed. And I'm like, remember the whole mom situation when she was visiting him in the dungeon and that's her trick and he can do the same thing. I was like, that's not Loki. And of course, Thor starts mourning and you can see like his skin turns. And I'm like, he really died this time. Saving, like actually doing an honorable thing. I didn't just feel sorry for him. I was like, okay, he was a hero. He didn't get what he wanted, but so that got me again. This bastard. You know, they say keep your friends close, but your enemies closer. Well, it depends on who your enemies are. Sometimes your enemies are so damn toxic, you just can't be close to them. But Thor's going to find out this mess, and I don't know what he's going to do. Well, well, he said don't betray me or I'm going to kill you. So, mm. can Loki be killed? I don't know. And I mean, I don't know. I can't think too much about it. Because, you know, I, I'll get a headache if I start thinking too much about things. I'm glad this was the second one I watched. I'd be too tired to watch, a sec like, one right after this. <laughs> I'll probably watch two more tomorrow. It was really good. I, I did enjoy the first Thor better. It, it, it. It, like, set the groundwork and stuff. But this one, I don't know. I might like this one as much if I watch it again. Now knowing what's going to happen. Sometimes you pay attention more. And I need some freaking subtitles. I downloaded the subtitles. Where are they? Another good movie. <laughs> when they wear me out emotionally. And I start holding my breath because it's like, I don't know why I do that. I need to stop doing that. It's making me dizzy. This is really good. 
I'm really excited that I've started this series after the Harry Potter and the Fantastic Beast series. I hope that y'all have enjoyed watching these with me, <laughs> seeing it by my perspective, by my first time watching, obviously, and you obviously know what's going to happen, like, at the very end and I'm still like I'm getting there but like I like I said I know there's four phases I was given four phases but I'm only looking at them when I'm going to react I've noticed now in this phase like it did with Iron Man 3 it just says Iron Man will um appear again or something like that this one says Thor will appear again doesn't tell me when I'll be surprised Maybe with the whole Avenger group again, like, are we, are we going to start back over with, um, do we go back to Captain America? Do we, um, I want to know more about Hawk and, um, Scarlett Johansson. Uh, they've been through some stuff together because they've talked about fighting together before and it, it, it was referred to in the Avengers. I never get sick of seeing Tony Stark. I mean, he, I love, I love his character. The Hulk. Well, we saw him in... <laughs> We saw him in Iron Man three briefly, but he's part of the he's part of the Avengers also, and that's it so far, right? Loki messed up Eric's mind. I mean, he really, because Hawk was like, he was he couldn't even explain it. I'm just anxious to see what the next two are going to be. Thank y'all for joining me. Until the next Marvel movie and the next time, bye.